Wednesday, March 28, 2018 marks the third year that Nigerians voted for Muhammadu Buhari in 2015 to lead the country at a time the citizens had become impatient and desperately needed to see a change in the system. Buhari of the All Progressives Congress, APC, defeated the sitting president and candidate of the People's Democratic Party, PDP, thus ending the 16-year rule of the political organization that prided itself as the biggest in Africa then. Three years down the line, the presidency, while celebrating this feat achieved by Nigerians, has said the people of the country will not regret their collective decision to vote for the Buhari. It also expresses optimism that the president would be re-elected if he decides to run for another constitutionally guaranteed term of four years in 2019. Meanwhile, various politicians and organizations have variously called on the president to seek another term in office. We earlier reported that a former governor of Abia State, Orji Kalu, recently disclosed that the All Progressives Congress APC, will force President Muhammadu Buhari re-contest election in 2019. It was reported that Kalu said President Buhari will run for re-election going to run and if he says he is not running the member of the APC will force him to run. According to him, President Buhari will run for re-election, not a must but he is going to run. He has to run, and if he says he is not running, we will force him to run. Apostrophe.